All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Your host, the Raven, here. Um, we're gonna take on Zone C. Last time I was struggling, had a little bit of problems. Decided to take a break and uh, you know get back at it. So we'll try to take on C, D, and uh, E. And this uh, play through. Yeah, we gotta make sure we get those flowers, cause it's like, I've been dying a lot. Yes, every 10 stars and every 100 uh, flowers. Now this time man, it seems so easy. I don't know, sometimes you know just you have your days where you mess up and your days where you just kick a lot of ass, you know. And then she's seen some more saying the same things. So let's take on zone D. Now this zone D is actually a favorite level of mine. I love the music. Now the enemies in this stage uh, masquerade themselves as uh, false boxes. You can tell by the red color. They look like a box that you picked up. And that's what happens if you get too close to one, they start jumping up. But they're pretty stupid enemies, you know. any of the sound effects. Kill them, they'll keep popping back out. Damn, I missed. I was trying to hit both of them with the apple. Alright, these guys gotta stun them so you can pass them. Obviously, some of them you can just avoid. Fighting the rough throwing rabbit girls. Yeah, 
Yeah, just get there from a distance. Keep it from running off. And once again, you don't have to kill every single enemy on screen. Now those birds, they take two boxes. I hate those things. Alright, use a box to turn the switch off so the iron, the steel ball will quit rolling. Oh, damn. Now see, this one's on off already. So if you hit it, you'll accidentally turn it on. So I like the way they threw that little trick in. Oh, oh wow. I forgot that you standing on it will trip the switch as well. Alright, here we go. We got our life back that we just lost. Oh, Alright, here we go. And I forgot what the... You got a trick him but wait for him to go back inside. Now those boxes behind me, those purple things falling, I don't know what their purpose is. Ugh. These enemies are pretty annoying. Like, I hate situations where, like, you know, it's a high chance of you getting hit. I'm not going to hit anybody up in the face with an apple. There's a lot of um, flowers in this stage, which is excellent because I've died a couple times. Alright, for boss time. Ah, oh, I still got hit. That sucks. Um, on the rip on the NES and uh, not the emulator, the 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 balls you shot had different colors. We're almost finished with them. Oh yeah, we got zone C and D down. So now we have to take on zone E. Which when I was a kid, the boss for zone E was so hard. Like I used to avoid zone E just because the guy was so difficult. Alright, let's we'll skip the annoying dialogue. Just more tips from her. Um, unless you're like a three-year-old and, you, you know, you can't figure out the game. And just, she's not saying anything that's like revolutionary. I still don't know what those things are that, um, that are hanging from the trees. Like, I, I have no idea what they are. Like, still to this day, as an adult, let's get this beetle to come out. Ah, oh, damn, I should have hit in the box. I thought you could, like, outrun it.
down the boss though, that's what I'm really worried about. Oh shoot, I forgot you can't be holding the box. Well, well at least the, the one up star came back, that's great. Now if I don't screw up and not get it, that'd be awesome. Uh, let's skip the rest of this. Now I love this part as a kid, going past the water fountain. I thought it was so awesome. But when I went into the boss, I was like, this is unbelievable. It's so hard. And I like hammering through the concrete. It gave me, like, variety. And I also like handling the enemies. <laughs> I forgot how to throw away the hammer. Oh, okay, I gotta shoot it up, shall we? Alright, look for a hell full strength. And to be honest with you, even as an adult, I still feel a little bit uh, nervous. Wait, I should have took a took a box in here. You got all types of guys coming at us. Wow, we're getting worn up like crazy, baby. for boss time. It's like he fills the screen up with those razor blades. Ugh, you see that? That's what I'm talking about. The guys like insane. Like you really gotta like get the damage in on them. Damn. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. I mean, like that guy is like, he just fills the screen with razor blades. It's like, it's unbelievable. Like, oh, come on, I didn't miss my one star. And uh, we have a little tip from Gadget about how to defeat Zone F. So, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host of Raven. Thank you for uh, watching part two of my Rescue Rangers uh, playthrough. Um, I hope you're not making any of the mistakes that I'm making while playing this game. So we'll take on this stage and uh, stage G, and I think there's a, that we might do stage H um, in the next episode. So I'm your host, Raven. Thank you, and uh, have a good night.